Hey guys, a new tutorial. Today I'll be teaching you how to use MacX Video Converter Pro for Mac. Um, so this was a request from MacX company uh, to make a quick review for their program. Um, so here it is, I got the full version program here, um, licensed. So basically it can do everything, it can convert um, about 180 f uh, video formats, um, especially for iPhone, um, for Android and for other mobile devices and computer. Um, so you can actually um, convert videos from YouTube too, you can download them with the simple um, copy paste link and then you'll, uh, you can typically download the, the video. So um, first off, you can drag a media file here, so I'm just going to get a media file uh, from my computer. Um, okay, let's get a short, okay there's a short one there. Um, so this was a tutorial I made for YouTube, so here you have your profiles, um, the general profiles, MP4 video, um, so you have the higher quality and the lower quality for um, almost every or literally every um, format you select, and it says um, the higher quality is going to be the slower. So you got the MOV um, video, you got an iPhone, iPad compatible, Android um, or tablet compatible, and other sort of um, web media, other sort of um, profiles too. So we're gonna start. Um, we have uh, actually music profiles too. If you want to download only the music, and it has the recommended from all the profiles, it has the recommended um, profile for you. So mobile devices, you have everything compatible with Apple devices, with Androids. Um, Android tablets, Android mobiles, and you have Windows devices too, Sony, Blackbe uh, Blackberry, and Nokia, and you also have YouTube devices here. In the YouTube um, video profile, you have these three formats here, mostly used for um, vloggers and um, other people, especially YouTubers. So you got the video um, for Facebook, also the better compatible ones, Vimeo, um, General Web, others here. And you have the Mac General Video. Um, you can they're basically all the same. You have the the higher end um, speed encoder. So that you have the PC too. Um, basically, these are all compatible one uh, with each other. DVD profile as well, and HD video. So basically, this these are the profilers um, that you can select. So I'm just gonna go with the typical one. I'm just gonna go with. Uh, actually, the video is an MP4, so I'm going to I'm going to use. Um, I'm going to use the this one for YouTube. Actually, I'm not going to use the higher quality. So my I'm just going to use the lower quality so it's faster, so it doesn't take too too long. And now you can see everything you have here. You can go to you see your information, resolution, um, streaming bitrate, other stuff as well. As you can see, um, the time you can go to settings actually and select the output profile again if you're not satisfied with that one. You have the video codec, um, your frame rate, actually, you only use uh, 30 frames, um, better for YouTube. And you have other audio options. And you can ed actually edit it. So you can um, edit the volume if you're not satisfied with it. You can add a subtitle, you can trim the video. Hey guys, mute for. Okay, that was an error. Um, so you can crop and expand and watermark them. Not pretty sure. Oh, the transparency and other um, settings. Okay. Um, so you can actually you can rename it too. So have you typically everything you need here. Um, and here you can use the high quality engine. And um, you can use safe mode and you can use deinterlacing. Really know what that means. And you can actually um, set up what cores um, you want your CPU to use. And merge all, so you can um, download, you can um, convert all at the same time. Oh, you can add photos to your videos too. So this works also the YouTube um, downloader. So you can just paste the YouTube um, link here, and you can use your resolution um, depending on the for. You get two types of formats: um, MP4 and and 3GP, and then you can basically download um, nearly every YouTube video in my perspective and then just close it, it returns you to your normal video converter and um, so you can actually record um, your video from your camera and you can record your screen and that's basically it of this program I'm just gonna convert this and when it's um, ready I'm just gonna get back to you in a second and I'll show you um, a couple of parts of my video 
but uh, guys back to the video so I have um, the video converted here on my movies folder and um, where it exports so just to show you actually uh, it shows everything in the format here it's correct and I'm really surprised how a video with 2 minutes and 30 only has 5 megabytes so that's pretty insane um, and great for uploading videos so it doesn't take uh, much long so I'm just gonna review this video right here <coughs> Hey guys, new tutorial. Today I'll be teaching you how to get help. Alright, so the quality is pretty so fine, actually. Um, yeah. Actually, I'm surprised with uh, this video converter because I had I didn't have this idea about it. So if you want other quality, uh, other profiles, you can select other profiles um, and actually export it again if you're not satisfied with that one. And remember that I use it the lowest quality. So if I use the highest quality, maybe it would be um, quite better quality and it would be um, actually slower but you'll get that quality you're expecting so um, feel free to download, I'm gonna, just gonna link, leave the download link in the description for this program um, I'm gonna leave the not the full version for it but the trial version if you want to you can buy the program it costs forty five dollars um, if I'm correct and you have nearly every profile and you ha even have to you even have music profiles here so just mess around and see what's better for you uh, I hope you guys like this video so don't feel free to comment and like and leave a subscribe if you want more tutorials and more videos like this so thanks for watching